take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Manhattan houses 35,000 underground and 47,000 overhead transformers for its 10 million residents, and of those 82,000, about 35 fail every year, McGee says. A failure doesn't always equate to a fire or explosion either, in fact, in the steadily decreasing number of failures per year, such an explosion is rare. Make your mark, take our lead. Transformer substations located close to the living areas could induce high long-term exposures to extremely low-frequency magnetic fields of nearby inhabitants. Some of the researches have shown increased risk to childhood leukemia associated with the long-term exposure to the elevated levels of magnetic fields. Take our lead. That's about 42 pounds of steel, plus copper windings. Iron core transformer weight is typically 90% steel, 10% copper, so add on another 5 pounds or so of copper, and 3 pounds for the enclosure, and you have 50 pounds. The label on mine says it weighs 51 pounds, so Bob's your uncle and all that. Take our lead. Humming and buzzing noises are a common complaint with electrical transformers, which are a common sight in both industrial and residential areas. Even though a transformer has no moving parts, these vibration-like sounds are quite similar to those produced by generators and motors. Take our lead. A transformer can fail for a variety of reasons, but the most common causes include lightning strikes, overloading, wear and corrosion, power surges and moisture. Transformers contain mineral oil keeping the transformer cool. When it becomes overcharged, the wiring can create heat and a spark. Take our lead. It's also because of the presence of mineral oil inside the transformers. Although transformers have built-in mechanisms to turn off due to overload, sometimes it's too late and thus, the explosion happens. Temperature is a big factor too. Mineral oil has a pretty low igniting temperature at about 300 Fahrenheit. Make your mark, take our lead. One failure can cause many problems. A simple fault at the distributing end can cause blackout of power to the whole area. The fault can also be very dangerous as the transformers contain large quantity of oil in direct contact with high voltage components. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.